Warning! The following contains scenes of graffiti. Graffiti may be art, but it's also an act of vandalism and is a crime all across the world. The D-Rock 100 does not condemn any acts of this vandalism of any kind. Otherwise, the ones that are responsible will be given a fine, probation, or even a sentence to prison. Viewer discretion is advised. On with the show. It's showtime. Never doing that again. <laughs> yeah. Hey, everybody, it's a Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you just see that? Apparently, I stunted on top of Cube's head. Surprising that you didn't break on that one. But anyway, as I was saying, welcome back to more of Jet Set Radio in the future replay. Last time, we ended up. Having a little bit of some issues in a boat with 5,000 year old mummies who just like can't take hits. I accidentally killed one of them again. And to put it put in a nutshell, 99th Street has just got a new paint job all over the place. This time, we head out for uh, one that I'm not really looking forward to the Tokyo Underground Sewage Facility. Jitsit! Jitsit! JSR! Jets up for the old! Is it sad to say here that I'm getting very tired of this song? Well, then again, I ain't really one to judge, but. Win! Tokyo Underground Switch facility, here we go! Okay. So let's take a look at the map. We got some locations for us and that we need to go to, and they are not gonna be a bunch of happy bunnies with us. But you know what? I'm curious about something. Let me, let me take a look at this place. I wanna check here real quick, see how bad it looks here. Okay, yeah, it was pretty bad. Okay. So now that we have got an idea for what to lay out from here, this is what I was talking about from earlier. That there's going to be some graffitis that are going to be not friendly towards us. And I consider this one to be one of the most annoying ones. In fact, personally, I kind of consider this to be the second most annoying one. Because they're going to be in locations, and that's going to be annoying as heck! Alright. Nope! Don't want to do anything stupid. Oh boy. Like I said, not gonna be friendly towards us. <laughs> In fact, what I probably should have done is just a boost dash enough when I had the chance, but. Oh well. One meant to be. I guess while I'm going through this, a bit of a cool little trivia. In the original, Combo and Cube actually have a little bit of a connection with each other. Turns out the both of them are actually from a location known as Grind City. And after doing a little bit of some digging around, Grind City is actually in a location here in the... Yes, here in the place where we can have the controller to the controller part one and press start to continue. No, it's actually a location here in the United States. 
supposedly, if I remember this correctly, they arrived here in the in, in Japan. Correctly, they came here because, of course, there were Rudy's that were trying to escape Grand City. Who the was? They also had with them a friend of, I think his name was like Tempo. I believe it was. Oh. It's Tempo or, or something doesn't matter. Um. See, so yeah, Combo and Cube are very well acquainted with each other, and they actually are Rudy's traveling the world trying to find a place where they want to be at. Unfortunately, the Rukaku police that ended up getting, catching up to him. I think it was the, was the police? either them or or the Golden Rhinos. But either way, Combo and Cube managed to get get away to safety. But it is unknown on if one has to become of Tempo. Oh. Yeah, my God. I'm thinking that's his name, and I want to apologize to those of you who have played the original Jet Grind Radio. If I am incorrect on that one. In fact, earlier I, I posted a little something on screen in, in case if I was wrong about the name, but you'll probably be seeing it popping up all over the place if I am incorrect in more in, in other locations. So, with their friend gone, Combo and Cube just kind of went their separate ways. Kind of feel a little bad here for them that they ended up losing their friend because, like I said, there's there's no information about what is what came of him afterwards. The only thing in that it is safe to assume is that he very likely may have died, or he is officially into hiding, and they he's probably one of those scenarios that he's someone where he doesn't want to be found. Just like with any other Rudy. Now, unlike other Rudys. He actually has a bit of a good reason behind it. I think it's because that if what I'm getting at is true, it is that he actually may have, if he is still out there, then my guess is that he's biding his time to regroup with his friends. But unfortunately, Combo and Cube never actually went after this person because they kind of have presumed he that he is presumed dead. No, not please make connect the controller to the controller with her part of one and press start to continue. No, what I'm trying to say, he is presumed dead. And his reason of why Combo and Cube never actually went after him or do any way start tracking him down. And his parents in the point to the point when I believe, now keep on, this is all just a theory that. Cube was so frustrated with this that she escaped into her 99th tree, thus creating her own group of Rapid 99, because it is confirmed that Cube started the Rapid 99. Now, I don't fully remember of Combo, though, but I do know is that he did join the GGs at one point during the main story of Jack Ryan Radio. Yeah. Pretty sad backstories when you think about it. No wonder why Rudy's life has such a hard life. Okay. Where's the next one? Up there? Okay. No question that really had any meaning to it. But I got it either way. Uh, would you go to the lab combo? Combo! What are you doing? <laughs> I, I, I don't know what happened. Like, apparently it was so focused on the bats and it, that it was able to get a graffiti that it got a little carried away. <laughs> or, or I guess in one's case, falling away. Okay. Now that we got that stupidity out of the way, and yeah, I'm really do hope that he actually bring him back someday, so we can actually get some more updates on what has become of him. For any of you guys who who played the original Jet Grind Radio, know more. I would like to know more about this because that's a character that I feel like it should really 
Give him bad hand because his time ain't to shine. But this is one of the reasons why I actually wanted to go for combo is that he actually has a very interesting backstory and in how he actually came from the United States. I don't know if Grind City is actually a real place, but I'll have to look it up later. If Grind City is a real place, that's definitely a location that's kind of of people in my interest. No 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 I guess I, I, now I think I'm stuck. <laughs> ah, right. I'm gonna be here a while. Oh, nope, wait, nope, never mind. I'm still here. I am still here. There we go. Again, for some reason I am getting hurt. So badly that it. Oh, you know what? Oh, I know what it is! My control is vibrating! That must have been be weakening the grip on the power grip on the battery! That makes sense! Jeez, I are totally smart. <laughs> Not. Okay. Oh, God, this one. I somehow got that on the first try. I don't know how. I refuse to ask questions about it. Just not an accept. Good day, sir. I'm so absolutely sure I didn't miss anything. Doesn't look like that's the case. Just good. Because I'm actually seeing some graffiti right up ahead. But the question of the day is... Three cans around here that I could hit you. Because if that's going to be not the case, then I'm going to have to do some double back. I don't think so. And that looks like to be a negatory. Okay, it looks like it's just those ones in particular. No, it doesn't look like it. I am going to... Oops. I am going to pray... That I not go backwards. That there are more spray cans on the way. Because like I said, I might have to double back. Oh no. Oh no! That was an accident. I wasted my last break can. Oh no. Let the guy be on my side today. Oh, oh, was that one? I can't. Oh! Oh boy, am I ever glad to see you! Yes! God's on my side! Yes! Okay. Don't know why I'm making such a big deal on that one, but you know what? Doesn't matter. Going up. Okay. Now with this part. Um... Unintentional uh, coming up here, but let's see here. What is this? I'm gonna get that out of the way. I don't know 
think there's one that's here, though. That there is not. Back down. I don't think there's any spray cans until a little bit further on, so... But there is that! Got five more to go. So far, doing not too bad. Gonna be fine. Oh boy. Okay. So these are where the last. So I was trying to say that's where the last ones are at. Just want to get all of these. Check out that style, baby. Sweet. There we go. Nope. Okay, thank God. Actually, you know what? I guess why well, I am coming back over here. Might as well. Get me some more health. Here. You know what? It's fine. Works. Works. More to go. Did, did I miss one? Where did I miss it at? Oh, okay. There it is. Alley you! Got him! All right! down here or we can have the game keep me around here I guess don't know how I did that but I don't really want to know how I did that but no reason we're coming back up here come on down okay Ow, yep. okay done and done all that said and done, we're gonna go ahead and end things off from right here. Now that we have covered the Tokyo Underground Sewage Facility, next time we go further in into the sewers and see if our own dashly graffiti were made everywhere on the walls at the bottom point of sewage facility. Yes. See you guys then.